Hey guys, welcome to uh, part five, part six of uh, GTA Five. I'm sorry for the audio; I didn't record. Uh, I, my uh, controller was muted. Uh, thank you guys for checking out part six, and uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy. Um, there's gonna be no audio until I believe somewhere around 14, 15 minutes. Um, Thank you guys for checking it out, and uh, we'll see you in a while. Thank you. The uh, when I, when my audio comes in is 10:34, 10:35. So if you want to fast forward till then, uh, you're more than welcome to. And uh, we'll see you at part seven. I got just a thing. Let's raise some hell, neighbor. Oh, I'm in. I'll introduce you to one of my all-time favorite pastimes. <laughs> You're gonna love this. Okay, you see them three big satellite dishes? A decent shot, and they'll go down easier than a whore's drawers. Yeah, that's it. Give them hell. Shoot another one. <laughs> no more reality TV for you, Mrs. Gilbert. Okay, one more for the road. <laughs> Didn't I tell you this would be more fun than a barrel full of pussies? Ooh, you're a classy date, Cletus. No denying that. <laughs> now drive us up to that abandoned motel. I got an even better idea. So, what now? We are gonna try our luck on something less stationary. Ooh, liberals? Nothing as slippery as that. You'll see. Well, we'll take your vehicle then. You've got... Way too much time on your hands. Nah, this is just a bit of foolery. I've been busier than hell with the real hunting. The money and wild organic meat these days, you wouldn't believe. Them hipsters will give you their parents' last dime for it. It's gotten so I can't even keep up with the demand no more. All this eat local, small batch, farm to table bullshit. You know, I could maybe use another pair of hands if I can get you up to snuff with that rifle. Here we are. I bet you never shut out the tires on a car before? Oh, you'd be surprised. Well, let's see what you got then. Ain't you gonna shoot anything, Cletus? Nah, I do this all the time, and I wanna see how you deal with a moving target. You got any extra money? Please. You ain't gonna get far without a gun. She gonna use the rifle I gave you? This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good plain old fashioned fun. Hellfire! Go for the tires, not the car. Don't be shy, tires don't feel no pain. You gotta be 10% smarter than the equipment you're running, my granddaddy always said. That's it, beauty! And again, Trevor. Nice! Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. Too bad, Trevor. Right, let's change it up. Come on, follow me. Just two fellers killing time in small town America. Don't get much better than this, does it? The two most popular guys in town. Am I glad I ran into you? Ain't nowhere near this fun being antisocial on your own. Whatever cranks your tractor, I say. What's up next on the hillbilly anarchist agenda? Ever shot anything with a face? Actually, let me ask it again. Ever shot anything with a face on four legs? Now, Cletus, it's important you realize I'm a man plagued by vicious rumors. Fine. Let's head for the roof. I seen some coyotes hanging around down by the road. Reckon it would be real neighborly of us to get rid of a couple. And we are nothing if not neighborly.
We'll get a better shot from up here. Him. Looks like we got two packs of coyotes down there. Take a few of them out and the rest should scatter. Ha! Sing to me now, song dog, and another. Dropped it like a bad habit. I think you got one more in you, Trevor. What? That should do it. Nicely done. I reckon you should tag along next time I go hunting out at Polito Bay. I'll show you how to bag an elk. Ah, why not? All right. Gotta go. I'll send you a...
Oh shit! Get into the second part of this. To the first part here. We're gonna go like this. Go up here. Come on in. Okay. What the hell's going on? There we go. You sure as shit are one there you go. white trash hillbilly Wallace. <laughs> You're damn right. <laughs> Chang, spreadsheet. Let's head outside and talk terms. La, 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 la. I'll probably talk Quite over the first part. Gentlemen, I think I have proved that my organization can handle weight. And I think I've proved that my organization is a reliable supplier. In short, it's you. Ah! A small patch to call my own on this godforsaken earth! Fuck! 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 Screw you! Screw you! Screw you! Screw you! Yeah, screw Why you. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <laughs> oh, love Trevor. This game is gorgeous right now. Wait, do you see all that? Look at all this. Look at all this. Look at the sky. It doesn't look like this is a PS3 game. It looks like it's a PS4 game. Transferred to PS5. How the hell was this on the PS3? I just spoke to that maniac Trevor. He's coming. Get down to the meth lab to protect it. I hope he don't get through these idiots, but we know they're idiots. Come on, let's go see them Chinese fellas. We know they're idiots, huh? Oh, how many brothers you got, you inbred freaks? I don't know. Oh, how I'm gonna do it. But I'll kill the lot of you, and I'll torch your cookhouse. I'm 
gonna kill you! How the fuck did I die? I'm curious. These guys are oh, dumb. How many brother you Look how good this game looks like. Freaks. I don't Look know how good this game looks like. Man. Kill them. Tears here to kill ya!
Duke of Death. <laughs> I can't believe that. Uh, yeah, let's do this. Do some side missions, why not? There you are, handsome. Hello, Ma. How have you been? Oh, simply wonderful. And you? About the same. Somewhere stuck between joyful and peachy. Hmm. Even in this world full of scum and detritus, it's only right that we all bear our share. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> Take this poor wretch. On the run, desperate, alone. About to learn the true meaning of suffering, all for a few thousand bucks. Think you can find him for me? Every man has his talents, Maud, and the rigorous administration of justice is, uh, is one of mine. That's why I love you, Trevor. I'll send you his file. Now we can, uh, go to Trevor's house. Back here. You're not even hidden. <laughs> Have you got it? I've been trying, Trevor. I've been trying. Come on over here, all right? I ain't gonna hit you. I've been trying. I know, I know. Oh, God. I, I thought you said you weren't gonna hit me. I thought you said you were gonna find fucking Michael Townley. There's two. Michael Townley living in LS. One is 83, and the other one is at kindergarten. I asked a teacher to put him on the phone just to be safe, but she threatened to call the cops. I ain't no molester, Trevor. Shut up before I molest you, all right? Now, is there anything else? <laughs> I, I looked through the phone directory. I did find a, a Michael DeSanta, uh -huh. about the right age, married with two kids. What's his wife's name? Amanda? Amanda? Yeah. You're a genius, you moron. Come on, come here. Woo! <laughs> Don't you ever not tell me things I want to know! <laughs> hey, Trevor. Run, you little bastard! Get out here! We're going to Los Santos! Are we? Not you, me and Wade. What about me? You're CEO of Trevor Phillips Enterprises. Find us some business so that we can make some money. Mm. And tidy my shit up. Let's go. Wait, come on. I'm driving. You can jerk me off if I get bored. <laughs> I'm joking. You can suck me off. <laughs> Are we gonna stop for ice cream? <laughs> oh, <sorry>. Um. <laughs> so, so, so we're heading to Los Santos soon? Soon. I gotta make a stop. Oh, what's your stop? Ice cream? Road trip? We taking this one? Get in! Where are your people at in Los Santos? It's just my cousin there, Floyd. He's bumped in with his girlfriend someplace called Vespucci Beach. So, uh, what's your stop? Family's important, Wade. 
Not as important as the man that's employed you, mentored you, and fed you amphetamines this last year, but it's important. We gotta pay this cousin a visit. I ain't seen him in a while, Trevor. All the more reason to drop by. Okay, um, that might be nice, but where are we stopping on the way? Cause you know, I'm getting kind of wet over here. For fuck's sakes. Another chapter the lost has descended on this fine town. Looking to mourn and maybe revenge their dead. I was thinking me and you could pay our respects. Trevor, I, I, I don't think we'd be welcome there. I mean, what could you want to... Camp's up here. I'll wait till dark before I drop in again. The assholes here, they slipped. Ice took a hold of this whole place. You're lost, but you are not forgotten, brothers. We'll find that motherfucker. I got you them bombs and that pistol with the thing that makes it quiet on it. Yeah, I took them. Those are my gifts for these pricks. Wait here. Don't get killed. I'll try not to get killed. Trevor Phillips! Get out of town, you assholes! Oh, I can't believe I just did that. The lost aren't welcome here! Mind fuck. 
I'm gonna stick my bow in your eye. It's gonna come out of your ear, huh? <laughs> I didn't mean anything by that, P. Trevor, lube up your eye hole, fucker, because I'm gonna fuck your tiny mind, huh? I'm about ready to turn you into roadkill! <laughs> Please, don't turn me into any- No! Don't turn me into anything! I just want to be Wade. Are we nearly there yet? No, Wade. Are we nearly, nearly there? You keep this up, you're not gonna get there at all. Can you tell me a story? No, Wade. Let's play a game then. You know animal, mineral, or vegetable? I'll go first. I'm nanotechnology. Uh, you're what? Oh. Oh. You're what? Oh. Damn it. I gave it away. I wasn't, I wasn't supposed to say what I am. I'll start again. Animal, vegetable, or mineral? Hey, hey, hey. How about this? I'll tell you a story if you promise never to speak again. I like stories. Of course you do. This story's about a boy called Tri... Tri... Uh, Trisha. Is Trisha a boy's name? It doesn't matter. Sounds weird. He was weird. He was the smartest, toughest, weirdest kid in Canada. Well, in the Canadian border region of America. Okay. This boy, he had all the talent, charisma, and guile that a boy could have. Right there. Los Santos. The end of the fucking Earth. This is the place! I seen it on the holiday card. So, this is Bo Santos. I guess it is. I always wanted to come here. But you got stuck in the desert? It's still San Andreas. Best part of the state. Santos. So, Michael, this is where dead men come back to life. It's been nearly ten years, but you'll keep for another day or so, huh, old friend? You motherfucking fuck! I grieved for you! You weren't even fucking dead. You were my best friend. Well, guess who's coming to shit on your doorstep, you fuck! Floyd ain't around here. What are you doing? <laughs> Los Santos, the city of shitheads. Where else would he be? It's this Fuji Beach. Where he's staying. Will you tell me the story? About that boy, Trisha? Ah, yeah, yeah, Where were we? Right, 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 right. So, this kid, he could fly planes. So, he signed up for the Air Force to fly all day long and bomb villages and maybe, just maybe, drop the nuke. And it was all going well until one day, just before he got his wings, an evil witch in charge of psychological evaluations told him he was unstable and grounded him for life. That's terrible. It was. Sent him into a deep pit of doubt and despair. And just then, ju just as he hit rock bottom, he met a fat, silver-tongued troll under a bridge. That's cool. What was the troll's name? Mike. Mich Michelle. A lady troll? Yeah, he had tits like one. No, no, he, he was a boy. Michelle is a funny name for a boy. Well, this was a funny boy. He sat under his bridge, robbing anyone who passed him by. Sometimes he'd go into town and rob the shops and inns and such. And he persuaded our hero that maybe he should rob people too. And you know what? Little Trisha did rob people. And little Trisha was good at it. And they lived happily ever after? For a while. Until the troll met another troll in a strip club. And they fell in lust. And he bought her a pair of fake troll tits. Even bigger than his real troll tits. So she could make more money stripping. Maybe a little... Maybe a little on the side without call work. But you didn't hear that from me. Wow. And then... Oh. Oh. 
We're near Floyd's house. I seen it on the iPhone maps. I'll give you directions. Just keep on a minute. You don't turn here. So now here's like a rat. It's straight here. This is the place, I think it is at least. <laughs> Cousin Floyd! Come up here, Trevor! Floyd, it's me, Wade! Who? Me, Wade, your cousin! Who? Your cousin! Fuck! He's come to visit you, you rude fuck! Now get up off the floor and fix me a fucking drink! <laughs> oh, you, wait! I heard you was off smoking meth somewhere. No, not somewhere here. He's gonna smoke meth here. Give me a fucking lighter. You can't smoke here. Okay. <laughs> this is my girlfriend's place. She's at a business conference. You can't smoke here and you can't stay here. How's it going, cousin? It's been a while. Yeah, I ain't seen you since you was called Nevelyn's bed. A guy was never approved. You gotta go, both of you. My girlfriend, she'd kill me if she knew I had guests. Huh, it's not much of a girlfriend if she don't like your family. Now, would you get me a fucking drink? I'm not gonna ask you again. Oh, yeah, okay. Wait. I ain't got no booze. Then you go out and fucking get me something. You go too. part six uh, thank you guys for checking this out and uh, we'll see ya